authentically, I guess I'd be like, this is the third take because <laughs> the other ones are shit. <laughs> um, all right, it's rolling, yeah? Hey guys, we're here at Santa Clara. Very stoked to be here. We flew in earlier this morning from LA. This is really a day in a life of being an entrepreneur, what it looks like. I'm giving a talk later tonight. I'm looking to empower you, right? Empower people, empower college students. Being smarter around their money and not necessarily like have them be limited or constrained with their financial situation. The talk is called Bougie on a Budget and I'm right there with you in the journey of discovering what it looks like to be bougie on a budget as an entrepreneur, as a recent college grad. And I'm really excited to be giving this talk to all the undergrads. Instagram stories. This is Bliss. Say hey, what's up. Hey, what's up? <laughs> Just landed in uh, San Jose. About to get picked up by Frankie. Oh, these are neat. Look at this. this is cool. ah. Do I just release? Yeah, what? it's 15 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> Got a videographer and building up. What's up, brother? Before that, we have the freshman. The mess starts at 5 30. What's up, guys? Day in life. Oxford's in vogue. Preparing my schedule. All right, so just finished from Lucas. Now we're going to Palm Drive. So this is where I actually used to hit on Jude. She would be studying, and I would uh, find out what she's doing for work and just spark a conversation. <laughs> hey, hey, where were you sitting when I was hitting on you? Right over here. Hey. That's the, that's the table, that's the money maker. Hashtag baller. What I'm looking forward to most for next talk is actually being able to learn a lot of knowledge around a subject that I particularly don't feel the most secure about, which is financial literacy, and learning how to practically apply it every single day. He's really great in front of an audience, not only authentically sharing his own stories, but actually being able to take a complex solution to a problem and make it relatable for anyone to be able to understand. So whether you're 17 or 77, there's a way that Nicholas is able to share and disperse information that's fun, relatable, and relevant. <laughs> Being bougie on a budget, to me, means having the freedom to do whatever you want, whenever you want, and still being responsible for your finances. Why do I think millennial finance is important? It wasn't something I'd even thought about during college or graduating. It took me until probably when I first heard Nick talk about it, it's like, I should probably start saving it if it's just like $10 every day. We live in a time right now that's super confusing, especially for millennials and recent college grads. There's not a lot of help. How do you actually pay off your student loans? How do you get ahead of that? What do you do after you graduate college? And how do you just be responsible for money? That's what I'm here to impact. That's what I love doing. What I'm really committed to, what I'm really intending is that these students actually get power and freedom around their money. You better be ready for it. You better be ready for it. Anything else? I love you. <laughs> Dang, this is heavy. Yeah, now you don't have to deal with it. Bliss makes me look good. Shout out to Bliss. <laughs> <laughs> 